Steve Young, the President of National Action Network, South Jersey Chapter. And I'm here all the way from Atlantic City to support everyone from North Jersey, Central Jersey, and throughout the country. If there's injustice, one place, it's injustice everywhere. When I seen the video of a person, a human being, being beat for over two minutes, and nobody did anything to stop it, yet they were videotaping it, and those officers didn't do nothing, it got out. This, we know this happens every day. And for someone to make a statement like this degree, to say they follow protocol, say it's protocol? So we're gonna hold him accountable too. And that's why we demanded three things. Reevy needs to go 30 days into the county jail so he can see what we go through. Number two, he needs to apologize to everybody, that quote that he made in the, in the newspaper, especially to the family members, immediate apology. We also want to see all the complaints that came from inmates inside this correctional institution, not only in, uh, in Essex County, but through all the counties. We need to have subpoena power so we can get those things. We can ask for subpoena power to get the video if they was going to release it. Uh, the paperwork, the complaints and everything that, every, that they was actually signed against this office before it happened. We would be able to subpoena those things. And, and now we can't even do that with, with the police officers. They ch challenged that up in Newark, right here. So when you review board, it's subpoena power. So subpoena power is very important to being transparent. Government, they bragged about being transparent, but they gotta be transparent for